with the National Zoo and Aquarium's newest resident. Elsa and Zingala recently arrived in Canberra from the Anne Van Dyke Cheetah Centre in South Africa. After a stint in quarantine, the playful 10-month-old cubs are thriving in their new home. They're spending all of their, their days running around the enclosures, checking out the, uh, the new animals around them. There's, uh, there's a few animals that, uh, that hang around the, uh, the cheetah exhibit that, uh, that's, that's exciting them particularly. So a couple of the guinea fowl get them very excited and, uh, and the neighbouring wallabies as well. The two females have been interacting with humans since birth and visitors to the zoo have the chance to get up close with the Meet the Cheetah program. Although notoriously difficult to breed in captivity, they're also part of an international breeding program. We're certainly very excited that hopefully in the not too distant future, uh, these two may receive themselves some, some mates. They'll be two males and uh, hopefully as they become sexually mature, uh, they will like each other and perhaps breed and also contribute to the, uh, to the breeding program. Cheetahs are classed as vulnerable on the endangered species list. There's between 7,500 and 10,000 left in the wild. As well as being part of the breeding program, Alsa and Zingala are also animal ambassadors. So a lot of people come into, uh, into the enclosure and, and meet our cheetah. They're learning about the cheetah, how wonderful they are, the importance of, uh, of saving the species, the conservation efforts. The new cubs are absolutely adorable and likely to be a very popular attraction. If you want to be one of the first to meet them, the zoo is open all Easter long weekend. Lauren Barker, Wind News. Very brave.